Best quote of the year so far in a tweet. Dr. Panty Bliss Cabrera. I keep thinking about only a couple of months ago and all the fury and outrage and furious tweeting and angry articles provoked by any suggestion that Israel had bombed a single hospital. And then Israel went and openly bombed every hospital. And she puts every in inverted commas, she means virtually every hospital. The press are reporting this morning that Israel has ordered people to leave a swathe of downtown Khan Yunus, including three hospitals. One of the hospitals, the Nasser Hospital, is one of only two hospitals in southern Gaza that can still critically treat ill patients. Doctors Without Borders say their staff are trapped inside that hospital, along with 850 patients and thousands of displaced people. This is a key part of the genocide. Destroy the health in infrastructure and kill masses of people uh, while you are uh, uh, doing it. So another reason why the government should join the South African case, and given all your hesitations in relation to that, it's a reason why people should march this Saturday and keep the pressure on the government to join that uh, uh, case. I um, just want to comment briefly on um, the points that were raised by the Keown Cola where he alleged that the left um, were promoting uh, anti-Semitism and playing a role in the rise of anti-Semitism in uh, Ireland. Uh, that's very rich uh, from someone who, whose history has been in a party whose Taoiseach at one stage signed a book of condolences uh, uh, after the death of Adolf, Adolf Hitler. Uh, and uh, um, uh, uh, there's a constitution that was written in part by an anti-Semite, an anti-Semite, Archbishop uh, uh, McQuaid, uh, which is in place to this day. And we stand for the replacement of that constitution with a socialist constitution that would separate church and state. Government still uh, 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 abides and say that's the best constitution this country could have. I just want to make it very clear, I'll conclude on this. The left is completely opposed to anti-Semitism. We stand with organisations like Jewish Voice for Peace, which oppose the Israeli government and what they are doing. Criticising them is not anti-Semitism. It's something which we are completely opposed to. Thank you.